big splash right here. Get him. Start it up. Good morning, every day. Every day. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> There's a little input in coming at you from the west coast of Florida today. We're on beautiful North Captiva Island. Can't access it by car, by the way. <laughs> yeah, the and golf cart only island. It's our third day here, if you're paying attention. Yes, you make sure you watch those other videos. And today, we're going to head over to the beach and actually fish from the beach today and not from the cool boat boathouse. <laughs> today, we are at the boathouse picking up the things we need. It's a houseboat, not a boathouse. I know I always say it wrong. A boathouse is a house you house put a boat, boat in. Boat a houseboat house is boat. a boat you house yes. with. <laughs> For some reason in my brain, I it can't is. say it right. Anyway, we're fishing with Elliot, the shark whisperer. We got Luke over here. And uh, we're we'll gonna get down to the beach and pack, catch some big sharks. Let's go. I'm ready. We're waiting <laughs> right. on Elliot right now. Yeah, let's go, Elliot. Hurry. Oh, and not to forget, this video is brought to you by Landshark Lager, who really is one of Darcy's greatest uh, sponsors, and they really help us with a lot of this travel stuff. I've been course. drinking them since noon. And Elliot, too. Yeah, he's been, he starts drinking really early. He drank all my land sharks. He drinks all the land There's sharks. There's two left. <laughs> we brought five cases, and we've only been here for 18 hours. Yeah. That's how good it That's is. That's a slight exaggeration. That's yeah. how good it is. It's so delicious. Anyway, Luca, how many have you had? Just kidding, he's underage. Drink responsibly. Oh. Oh. We made it. Beautiful day. Beautiful ocean. And today is actually the last day of 2020, of 2020. <laughs> All right, so basically I've got my 15 foot rod here spooled up with 80 pound braids. A little bit low on line because you kept getting cut off by boats, but uh, from there, this 80 pound braid, I'm going to 80 pound mono leader. Um, I like fluorocarbon better, but this is cheaper and works just as well. Got a little bit of a, I go to a swivel here so I can adjust my weight easily. These spider weights hold really well. And we're fishing right at the edge of the pass where there's a ridiculous amount of current here. So this is an eight ounce claw sinker and they hold really, really well. And I got about two feet of wire, got this circle hook and a fresh mullet there. Um, but basically, these are so key for when you're fishing in, in hard current like that. And these 15 foot rods really help to be able to you know, cast something you know, uh, this heavy. So yeah. basically we're casting a pound and a half at the end of it. But yeah. Was, uh, we're not far away from where we were fishing last night, absolutely crushing it. So we're just trying to get some baits out and see uh, see what we can do over here. All right, so like I've been repeating over and over, follow him on Instagram, ACK Sharks. I'm gonna link his information down below. But you know, he's a pro at casting these long rods and he's an expert, so I'm gonna let him do it and learn from the pro. Yeah, at least the first okay. couple. Like it, we gotta so get a shark. Yeah, yeah. And All he's right. gonna send it way out there. All right, let's I'm do this. Cut Cuts like butter. Nice. Perfect. Bait breaker getting it done. Nice. You know, there's a we're right here in front of this nice little there's a sick trench here, I guess, with the sharks and all kinds of fish go up and down. So right. we'd have to have a nice New Year's Eve here in North Captiva and yep. uh, see what happens. That's all. That was a perfect cast. Great way to Beautiful. end the year, right? Yes. Oh, too short. Fell right in that trough too. Heck yeah! I'm talking about that. Yeah, buddy. That's what's up. That's what's up. We just got fresh shark bait. We just got also mullet catch clean cook, baby. These are studs. Delicious smoked mullet. Big splash right here. Right there. Right there. 50 feet off the beach. 50 feet off the beach. All right. Next one, I'm doing it. Setting the hook like that. That was sick. Now this fish is running. Woo! Solid shark. There he is. Nice. Really nice. I love power knobs. How are you doing, Sizzle? All right. I'm getting sore now from the last couple of days fighting sharks right here on my hip. Oh my God. A lot of you guys ask me, does that hurt? Yes, it hurts. And I just suck it up and I'll have a nice bruise there. No big deal. 
Oh, he's so close, but he's not done yet. You get fish, whatever it is. You got the drag set good? Yeah, it's a good palm in the thing. I hate when she does that. I, I yell at her. <laughs> Here we go. Elliot hand lining in the last few feet. And we're gonna get this big fish in on the beach. Yeah, baby. Go, Elliot. This might be a huge sandbar. Oh, oh yeah! Look at her! Hey, language! Nice! Hell yeah! Language. Here goes the shark wrangler! This is what he does best! He's gonna wrangle the shark! Let's go! Get him! Get him! Yeah! That's a stud right there! Heck yeah! Nice work! That is a big one. That is big. Heck yes. Nice fish. Luca, get this rod. Luca, Luca. Thank you. All right, now we're going to tag it and get this hook out. Yep. Because the hook Boy, out. It's still freaking out. This is really big for this species, honestly. Yeah. You can tell. I mean, they get the spots, the fins get kind of torn up. The male or a female? It's a female. Female. There's purple in the spots. This is a big old fish, man. Um, Circle hook right in the corner. It's still freaking out. I hate, I hate messing with this species. All right, let her calm down. Wow, this thing is freaking. This is a powerful fish, y'all. Yeah. She's not done yet. But we got to get this hook out. We're going to get a release, get a couple Darcy, quick picks. Can you get the, get the pliers and, and get the hook if I hold it like this? Where's the flies? Where's the flies? This I'll one. put the tag in real quick. Yeah, get the, tag, the tag in. tag first. All right. He's got the tag all ready to go. That was an awesome catch and release, and that sandbar shark swam away strong. And what we did during the active release process, we were taking photos, and you're not allowed to stop and take photos of these fish. You have to do it during the active release. So that's what we ended up doing. And like I said, the fish swam away strong. All right, guys, another great day. We had a great day on the beach with Elliot. Yeah. <laughs> it was awesome. Yeah. Quite a nice sandbar and tons of mullet. Beautiful day. Beautiful day in Florida. Yeah, Living was, our dream. Yeah, it was totally awesome. Hope you guys got some of those tips. Now, on the sandbar sharks, you know, they're kind of one of the more protected ones. You got to keep them in the water, right, Elliot? Right, yeah. And in you, the water, and, let them go. Tag them if you can. Yeah. Tag them if you can. And you can't really just stand here and take pictures of them. You got to let them go right away, okay? So, and you got to keep them in the water. You got to get your permit in Florida to catch sharks, myfwc.com. Yep. And uh, that's about it. I want to say thanks to Land Shark Blogger, the foxes, yes. Elliot. Follow Elliot at Axe Sharks. I'll put it right, I'll put it right here. Woohoo! 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 We really got an accident. Take care. <laughs> oh Good thing God. I was filming. Gotta drive safe. All right. We're going to take a uh, boat ride back to Sanibel. Yep. And then we're on our way home. And we'll see you next time. And until then, follow your, your dreams, dreams and, and keep, keep on catching. catching.